Fatal Fury here on the Super Nintendo. Man, you gotta love that name. Especially odd for a Super Nintendo game to have the name Fatal in it. <laughs> Since Nintendo lets it censor everything. Maybe like Final Fury, but no, they call it Fatal Fury. <laughs> and somebody's gonna die. Yeah, so this is a very early Neo Geo fighting game, so you can only select from three different characters. Yeah, Terry Bogard, Andy Bogard, and Joe Moyashi. Yeah, you have this cool storyline of two brothers trying to avenge the death of their father and the friend who likes to take along with them. So basically you only have two attacks you can use, both a kick and a punch, and the air button is used for throwing. Nothing special, but it works. Yeah, the fireballs are definitely weird in this game because they don't go fully across the screen. can still do special moves and everything, but they're very slow to pull off. But they're worth doing because they do a ton of damage. Definitely works a lot better than the stupid moves you had in Fighting Street or Street Fighter for the Turbo CD. Richard Meyer. Yeah, I told in the Japanese original that it has more of a Brazilian name. Wait a <laughs> I think it's more like a Ricardo Maya. Oh, because he has more of a Capoeira type of fine style. Yeah, really old guy. Let's be him up. <laughs> okay, better be careful. Holy shit! <laughs> I gotta be really careful. Come on! Steroids should be banned here! <laughs> Oh yeah, I remember that from the Neo Geo one too. I remember it being a lot faster. <laughs> yeah, sadly there are a little bit of low times in this. <laughs> I just beat up a 90 year old man. No, but that's a cool thing about Fatal Fury here. It might be a little bit slow at times, <laughs> especially here on the Super Nintendo. But at least it gets to showcase this awesome game to a broader audience. Yeah, it was popular on the Neo Geo and the original Neo Geo MBS hardware. Whoa! But here on Super Nintendo, yeah, it can get an all new audience. And you get to see all the cool different characters you get to fight. Yeah, the music is pretty cool here, but it sounds so much better on the Neo Geo hardware. Yeah, the vocalists are gone, unfortunately. Yeah, not the most exciting bonus stage ever, but hey, it's something. Yeah, there's a phrase, kicking tires out there, that means people are lazy or they don't want to buy anything at shops. <laughs> Here I'm actually literally kicking tires. <laughs> okay, once you defeat the four main bad guys, and then you go on to the second part of the circuit. Alright. <laughs> Yeah, one thing you're gonna notice about Fatal Fury here is that the fighters love to cheat. Yeah. Or this guy picking up a strange bottle in the middle of a match to become more aggressive. Yeah. Thankfully, he's still one of the more easier enemies in the game.
Oh shit. <laughs> So this is not good news. <laughs> Read it. No, it's not the dude from War Combat. It's something a little bit bigger. What do I mean by big? Hi. Yeah, a 430-pound giant. <laughs> Pro wrestler that loves to cheat as well. Whoa, yep. Yeah. Definitely got a sticky move with this guy. But you can still throw him, <laughs> oddly enough. Yeah, this is actually Big Bear from, you know, <laughs> Fatal Fury 2. But he's wearing a mask. Yeah, Fatal Fury here for Super Nintendo. <laughs> it's a decent enough fighting game. Nothing special. Okay, so not only are the graphics and music a lot more you know, toned down from the OG original, but they also took out the 3D jump in in the foreground and background. So it's more of a straight up old school fighting game, where the Neo Geo was a bit more innovative that way. Got a lot of cool, colorful characters in here. Yeah, if you know a code, you can still play as them. Even though it's an old school fighting game, it still holds up. And each character you fight in this, you know, tournament here has a unique story to them. Here we got this great dancing goof. <laughs> yeah, we got Boxer. Then you get characters that like to cheat, <laughs> like Billy Kane, who actually uses a long staff in his fight. And you can't forget about the main asshole himself, Geese Howard, who is the one who actually killed, you know, the brother's father. I give the original Fatal Fury here on the Super Nintendo a 63 out of 100. A bit old school in its design, and yeah, it has aged a lot, but it's still fun to play. <laughs> Yeah, no pick Joe here, he kind of stops. Okay, this is Arizona's World Champion, over and out.